Welcome to my website. My name is Danila. I'm a battlefield guide specializing in the Italian campaign of World War II and in particular the Monte Cassino, Anzio and Rome battlefields. I have a master's degree in history and archaeology. In 2005 I was certified by the Italian Tourist Board to work as a professional guide. I'm uniquely qualified to tailor your historic tour based on your special interests, including the experiences of your father, grandfather, uncle, or other loved one who was involved in the Italian campaign. I was born and raised in this region known as Ciociaria, which is strategically located north of Naples, south of Rome. Today it's a very beautiful area of lush green valleys and stunning landscapes. In 1944, however, it was the scene of some of the most severe fighting in World War II as the front line stalled here for several months. My family has been living here for generations and during the war suffered terrible losses as did thousands of other families living in this area. Anzio and Monte Cassino were two of the most brutal battlefields of not only the Italian campaign but the entire war. The fighting here included trench warfare, hand-to-hand -hand combat, a slow advance with heavy casualties inflicted on both sides. In many ways, it was similar to the battles of the First World War. On the 8th September 1943, when it was publicly announced that Italy surrendered, the German army occupied Italy militarily. It was a global war, everyone was affected. The losses among civilians and soldiers were huge. It is estimated that only in this area some 10,000 civilians and several thousands of allied and German soldiers died. It was a disaster. The key to the German defense in Italy was to control the high ground. The Germans from October 1943 started building their defensive line to slow down the advance of the Allied forces. This was especially true in the casino area, which occupies the narrowest part of the Italian peninsula. At Monte Cassino, the Germans built their main line of resistance called the Gustav Line. The area was naturally defended by the high mountains and fast-flowing rivers. The Allies were fighting in miserable weather conditions, with limited resources over difficult terrain and against the elite of the German army. It was a nightmare for the individual soldier to fight in Italy. The battles that took place at Monte Cassino and Anzio have often been overshadowed by other campaigns and events of World War II. During my tours, you will learn not only about the military battles, but also about the German occupation, the impact on civilians, and what happened to the Italian army during those terrible months. I've spent countless hours researching the military archives of the armies that were in action during the Enzo and Monte Cassino series of battles. I've traveled extensively through the United Kingdom and the United States and have been granted the unique access to examine battlefield maps, duty rosters and other relevant military data related to the Italian campaign. I will do my best to show you the route taken and the obstacles encountered by your family member. You will come away with a great appreciation for the hardship they endured and the service they provided in liberating my country. Many thousands of these young men paid the ultimate price and never returned home. If you're planning to come to Italy to pay homage to the greatest generations, the best way to experience the battlefields is to take a guided tour. Our innovative and unique tours will enrich your experience by utilizing onboard audiovisual displays. History will come alive as you view our multimedia presentations while we are en route to the various sites. I truly enjoy putting together tours for relatives of veterans and anyone who is interested in the Italian campaign. I will spend time in advance of your tour, researching, planning and arranging the best visit possible. I personally lead all the tours and you can be assured that I'll do my best to make your experience a memorable one. I've conducted hundreds of these tours over the last decade. I've met many veterans who wrote such an important page of our history. They provided me with some of the most memorable days of my life. I shall be happy to share my knowledge with you. It is key that you let me know as far as, as in advance as possible what your plans are and what specific unit your relatives served in. 
It is also important to allow enough time in Italy for such a once-in-a-lifetime trip. I recommend at least two days of touring, with the first day visiting the regular World War II sites, followed by a special day tracing your veterans' movements. I also lead other kind of tours in Roman surrounding areas, including entrances skip the line to the Vatican Museums, Sistine Chapel, Colosseum, Roman Forum, Roma Underground Tours, as well as wine and food tastings to enjoy every aspect of the Italian culture. I'll be happy to assist you with your planning and give you advice to make the most of your trip. I'm looking forward to welcoming you in Italy. Thank you. Mm -hmm.